good morning good afternoon good evening depending on your time and depending on when you're going to be seeing this video it's about your boy cost reps corner like i always tell you guys it's my corner it's your corner and it's a corner you know sometimes when they tell you that karma is a you would think that yes yeah, somebody is telling you something that is not true i could remember during the time of this election the last election this particular man known as asari dokubo was among those persons who embarrassed he peter obi and other personalities who were contesting for that election and supported alaji bola ahmed tunubu and then stood by him through all thick and thin and set off kind of things for him and against others you could remember if you have not watched those videos please go back to the internet and check if you think i'm lying today that same person is coming again to complain that the people of his own region are complaining that they have made a very wonderful mistake so what are you not telling me let me tell you if god wants to punish you he makes you fool yourself and then comes and punish you that's how god works i don't want to talk much i want us to watch this video that just came out yesterday i got it yesterday from asari dokubo direct instagram page where he was complaining that the his region is complaining that they have made a mistake in voting in bola ametunubu as the president of nigeria this man is lamenting this man is complaining he feels betrayed i see maybe because his compensation has not gotten to him i like the way bola ametunubu has ignored him abandoned him neglected him <laughs> I, I i love those patterns because maybe that's why he's feeling so bad anyway i would not like to talk much the video is already long let me allow us to hear what he said and i hope that uh, he learns his lesson the next election that is coming up in three years time but for now let's watch what asari dokubo said against bola ahmed tunubu and what he says about mistakes that the people think that they have made in voting in alaji bola ahmed tunubu as the president of nigeria let's just try and watch this video and please give your opinion in the comment section i haven't said i want to thank you for always being there I come away next time to see me your screen guys i leave us with this very funny video yes i call it funny because it's really funny let's go watch together president ahmed bola tunubu There are a lot of things involved in this river state matter. And as a friend, I am advising you, if you are not careful, river state will become your abatros. Like the ancient marina. <laughs> you are going to carry it on your neck. Do you know why? River state have the largest number of Ijo people. And apart from the Fulanese and the Yorubas to a certain extent, River State people have, the Ijo people in River State are found everywhere. They are in Gabon, in large number, Equatorial Guinea, Cameroon, Sierra Leone, Liberia. They are all on the coast. And the job people act like one people. You have seen them in Ondo State. You have seen them in Edo State. You have seen them in Delta. They act as one people. They are like the immigrant Fulanese coming from everywhere. When one Ijo man is hot, Ijo people, it is very easy to rally Ijo people. They are the easy, one of the easiest people to rally around to come. You only need to say, ah, he's on, he's on, he's on, give me a me as a wana wana, as a wana wana, as a wana wana, and they will come. The ethnic card is already in this game. It just sentiment. You saw it job people in Ondo State. You, as governor, you even saw them in Lagos State. For the sake of one man, you are looking for money to implement your programs for this government, for this government to succeed. 
But for a few people, you are ready to throw this away? Why will any reasonable person decide to provoke it up again? Any reasonable person. Are there no advisors? Are they telling you like Nehru was sitting Why Rome burned? He was drinking and celebrating. Why Rome burned? I might have differences with sin. But I know his own people. I know them. And I'm telling you, when Allah Messiah came to make peace with you in Lagos, after the cried, I know his own people. They don't relent. Can you afford that? Because they will come like a tsunami. They don't need anybody. They don't need sin to give them money. They don't need sin. Nobody, no, no, nobody mobilize them with money in Lagos, in Ondo, in Edo, and in Delta. Nobody. The environment provide them with their money, with the money and the resources. To carry out the activities without looking, without blinking their eyes. You don't want to hear this naked truth. Okay, don't hear it. Don't hear it. If your people are already angry that this is the worst government. This government is against the job people. And you want to hard fire to petrol you want to add petrol to fire this is the worst government that's the feeling of the job people if nobody is telling you as a friend i will tell you the job people feel this is the worst government for them this is a nightmare for them and when we were voting, when, the, when we were campaigning for you, a lot of your job people called me, ah, President, you don't know Tinibu? You know everything about Tinibu? Tinibu is your friend, no? We hope, we hope he's not going to look the other way. And I assured everybody, I say, if Tinibu fails, hold me responsible. And today, the people are asking me, are you still on that, that if Tinibu fails, hold me responsible? River State is the litmus test. If there is going to be any fire, <laughs> it will start in River State. I cannot stop them. I, as an individual, I cannot stop them. I cannot even stand on their way because they will shove me aside. Let me tell you, nobody, if anybody is giving you assurance that he can stand in the gap between you and the job people, when the job people feel that your government is against them, then that person is your worst enemy. Because the job people will crush him. Whoever he is, whether he's an Ijo man or not, the job people will crush him. The earlier you call your minister and the governor to Abuja again to maintain the status quo, it, it, the better it will be. The better it will be. I am saying it. I have everything to lose. But if I don't advise you, I stake my life. I stake everything. I stake my businesses, 
the my source of livelihood for you to become president. And if I am unable to tell you the truth, if you are gov in your government, I have to stake everything for telling you the truth. I have started doing it now. I am staking everything to tell you the truth. It is left for you to hear, but the result you will see. The job people feel insulted. They produce over 80% of the resources in Nigeria. And 100% of the resources in Nigeria, the, the oil and gas, pass through their territory for export to all the terminals. All pipeline pass through Joland. And you look at them, you look at the job people, and you give us one third class minister. It has never happened. From go on to now, it has never happened. And all of us, some of us have tried as much as we can to see that these things change. No. Every day you remove Ijo people from the position. Ijo people consider Buhari government as the worst in this history of the Ijo nation. But even the people Buhari appointed and left, you are removing them. I'm putting on each other. The places, the few places where he kept them, you are removing them. <laughs> and you think some people are telling you, it's okay, we are going to handle it for you, they are deceiving you. And the easiest way for this fire is in River State. <laughs> when it starts, you won't get the oil you are looking for. You won't get the revenue you are looking for. They are telling you, you mobilize the army to kill each other people. Please do. The people who are advising you, mobilize each other people to come and to mobilize the army people. to come with the military to come and kill each other people so that you can easily implement the program they have laid out for you okay please do p2b cannot be right forget i will not support p2b so go with your p2b it's gone it's history River State will be the easiest. I have no. The first time I saw shook hand with uh, this thing was at the barrier of my king, as Alawedi Alale. I sat there. The governor came to greet me. That was where I was. I have not had any contact with the governor. So let nobody say. The same way. I did not see Wiki until my friends, my associates, feel that, oh, there's a need, let us go and see Wiki, and we went. And since that day I left, I have never gone there. Even when I'm supposed to call him, I didn't call Wiki. I'm saying it live. He's there. I didn't call him. I don't have any personal problem with Wiki. I don't have any personal problem with him. I hardly have personal problem with him. I say my mind, if you don't like it, okay. But Mr. President, <laughs> let me tell you, if you allow Wiki to push this as he's doing, <laughs> it, it, will, it will be very difficult for him to even come to River State. It will be difficult for those is 27 House of Assembly members to even have a place to stay in River State. It will be difficult for anybody if they think that they are going to impeach him and the job people will allow it. <laughs> it will be difficult to impeach him. 
Mark this word, I'm telling you. God knows. Nobody. It will be difficult to impeach him and bring a governor. It's not going to be possible. Go and ask in Ondo State. Go and ask in Delta State. The fury of the job people. They don't give a damn. They are hardly afraid of death. I'm telling you the truth. The earlier you hear this, you accept it. Call wicked. Call wicked. Call sin. Let them maintain the status quo. That is the only way. If they don't, Allah may say impeachment was a joy, a joy. So don't the person who su succeeded Allah may say was a joy. Good luck, Jonathan. He became vice president and became president. So it is not Allah may say as a matter. Try this one and see what will happen. Try this one and see what will happen. A word is enough for the wise.